colleges and universities are wrapping up their fall semesters. They're each taking a look back at how they strategically handled the pandemic. KQ2's Daniel Soxie talked with one COVID-19 task force member at Northwest. She brings us that story. This has been an absolute unique, unprecedented experience. Brad Scott is a member of the crisis management team, working throughout the semester with administrators and local health professionals to ensure that the fall semester went as smooth as possible. I think it went really well. I think we contribute that back to our, our, our planning efforts. Um, you know, we, we, we brought in people from, you know, various parts of the university with uh, very unique uh, perspectives and specialized perspectives uh, to make sure that we were accounting for a number of different situations and nuances and uh, response challenges that we would, we would, we figured we would be faced with. Northwest Missouri State was able to maintain positive COVID cases to only 155 on campus using a technique that is quite simple. One thing we did, I think might have been unique to us, I'm not sure if others implemented this or not, was you don't typically see a seating chart in colleges and universities. You heard that right, a seating chart. A term you probably haven't heard of since grade school is being used again in the college classroom. That was something new that we did this year. And what that, what that allowed us to do is know exactly um, where an individual was sitting in that class and we could go into that seating chart and know exactly how many, you know, what individuals would have been sitting within a specific proximity of that case. Allowing the kids to stay in the classroom and continue to learn. So instead of having to go in and, and not know who was sitting where and, you know, possibly having to quarantine the entire class, we could narrow that down to specific known individuals and, and hopefully keep the classroom, um, you know, in, in place as long as we possibly could. As the semester wraps up, the crisis management team has yet to make adjustments for the spring, but plan to take a hard look at the numbers and see what changes need to be made. Uh, as we do that, we'll step back and we'll work with our external partners, public health, medical professionals, and look at that a little bit more closely and see if we're see what adjustments need to be made. And if that's the appropriate way to move forward, then we can we can make sure that we, we do that. Reporting in St. Joseph, Danielle Soxie, KQ2 News. Students at Northwest are taking finals this week from home, and there is currently just one positive case at the university, that in a student athlete. St. Joseph.